So what's going on guys and welcome back to yet another video here on my channel Genius Reviews. This is another food review video. So if you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing. I do food reviews, product reviews and more content here on the channel. So hit that subscribe button and the like button if you like the video. So today's video has came to me from my friend Oscar from work again. Um, if you've watched my previous video, my Pergale or Pergala, whatever you say. Um, it's a Lithuanian chocolate company that makes chocolate since check this one 1952 so it's been going a long time um they make one of the weirdest chocolates i've ever had so the last video was dark chocolate with beetroot pieces that's right beetroot pieces so weird as it is um it's a thing people like it i tried it i liked it and then the beetroot got me uh, mouth went dry when i was eating chocolate that should never happen that's but it was alright, it was good, I ate it and I'm back with another video. So today's one is, thank you again Oscar for providing this for me, um, Pagali milk chocolate this time, so it's not dark and it has lavender and linseeds. So if you can see, lavender and linseed. So I don't know what a linseed is and I haven't googled it, so please guys if you have or you know, let me know in the comments below. So I'd be interested to know what that actually is. Lavender. Now that's something I've known my grandpa to grow in a garden, uh, very fragrant smelling, however I can't imagine it being in chocolate. Um, he has had some, Oscar the boy, he does beat me to it, so doesn't really smell much, so I'll open him and find out. But anyway guys, this is the milk chocolate Pagali video for lavender and linseeds flavour. Um, I don't know where they get their inspiration from, they must just walk through a few gardens, have a look about. That looks good. Chuck in some chocolate, guys. You know, that's... I've, I, t I don't know. So it's a Lithuanian chocolate company. Um, I'll try and read some of the instructions off the back. That's in... No. I won't because they're in Lithuanian. Um, oh, no. See, this is different because usually when you read a back of a chocolate, the English is there. On these ones, we're down here, guys. We're underneath the label, you know? Pagali chocolate guys. I've said it enough times. Let's see what it looks like. It's probably melted now. I've been playing with it too much. So let's get it open. All right, break that off. So it feels kind of bitty to touch. So there we have it. That is the Pagali. It's got the name across the front if you can read that. Can't get the camera to focus properly. It says the Pagali on it. Um, doesn't look like there's much in it, to be fair. It seems a bit... Oh, but the last one, the beetroot one, you could see the lumps of the beetroot. So this one, you can't see nothing but holes. So that's interesting. I can smell the lavender through the holes. <laughs> it tastes like I'm sucking the lavender. Like, I'm just sucking a lavender plant, like... Well... It's good, though. That's good. That is good. I don't think it's something I could eat loads of. But for the flavour-wise, that is good. It's weird. This is weird. Oscar, this is weird, mate. The lavender and the chocolate is perfect. It tastes so nice. But then you've just got seeds. You're left with just seeds. It's... You just have random... Like, they're like almost like tomato seed size. So they're really small and they're just everywhere in the chocolate. So it's weird having seeds in my mouth while I'm eating chocolate. But we go again. So, lavender and linseed. get a crunchiness with the seeds I get that but for me could you just put rice krispies in there not even posh people eat crispy seeds you know who eats crispy seeds birds birds eat crispy seeds and um yeah so Pagali if anyone's watching from there in the UK we have a thing called rice krispies cocoa pops even work you know chuck some of them in 
So flavor guys, flavor first. For me, it's a seven out of, out of 10, seven out of chocolate, it's a seven out of 10. It's, it would have been a 10. It would have been a straight 10 had it not had linseeds in it. Bugatti chocolate, you make good stuff. Who puts lavender in chocolate? People just put lavender usually in the garden. But in chocolate, it's nice. And thank you for letting me try that. But on the other hand, linseeds don't need to be in there. They don't really do much for me. I don't know what they are. It's just annoying. Oscar, you've thrown me out yet another good chocolate bar to try. Thank you so much. Also, I might be doing a video with Oscar soon on um, something that he's eager for me to try from Latvia. And I'm willing to try anything from around the world. And I thank you all guys for watching. My name is Ethan. This channel is Genius Reviews. This was my Pagali review of lavender and linseed chocolate. And I'll see you guys in the next video.